So today I'm going to show you how to curl your hair with this 19 millimeter Jose Aber um, clipless curling iron. This is the box. And I'm embarrassed to say that I got it at the mall. <laughs> I was solicited into buying it. Anyway, this is what it looks like. You can see it doesn't have the little clip thing. And it comes with this crucial heat protective glove because it gets really hot. I think it's like 400 degrees. So, um, we're gonna get started. I've already sprayed Chi Iron Guard 44 in Kelsey's hair. So I already started off by sectioning her hair off. And you can see I just pulled the hair from the crown of her head. If you have a lot more hair, you probably want to do a few more sections. But I'm just gonna do two sections in her hair. Stay right like that, because I'm gonna do one. So I'm gonna put on my heat protected glove. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab a section. And I'm grabbing a section that's about, it's like an, one inch. And what I'm going to do oh my God. is I'm going to start from the inside. So I'm putting the curling iron underneath. And I'm going to wrap the hair around the barrel. Like so. And then I'm going to hold it there for like five or seven seconds. And I'm going to take the hair and slide it off the barrel. You can see the curl. Okay? I'm going to do the same thing all the way around her head. So I'm just grabbing sections that are like one inch, between one and two inches. I'm going to take the curling iron, I'm going to slide it under her hair, wrap the hair around the barrel and I'm holding it on for like seven seconds and I'm going all the way to the root of her <laughs> hair without touching her scalp so I finished curling the first layer of her hair as you can see, and then I'm going to actually do two sections, so I'm going to let down the second section, and I'm going to start doing the same. All I'm doing is I'm grabbing a piece of, the hair, like one to two inches, and I'm going to wrap the curling iron underneath, and then wrap the hair around the barrel. And then I'm going to slide the hair off and I'm going to drop and let the curl drop down. So I just finished doing the second layer of her hair and with the last layer I'm going to split it into a few sections. And I'm going to bring this to the side. And I'm going to put this side back. And I'm going to start by curling this side. Kelsey! <laughs> and I'm actually going to bring this like so. Clip this piece up. And I'm going to start curling this side of her head. And I'm going to let this part down. So you can see this side is done. And I'm going to do the same exact thing this side. And for her bangs over here, I'm not going to do like a full curl. I'm just going to wrap it around once. Like so this took like 10 minutes. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> do like a full swivel. <laughs> and that's what it looks like right now. Next. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to go through the curls with my fingers and kind of like separate them. You could use a brush if you wanted more like or less defined curls I guess. Just separating them with my fingers. And this adds like a lot of volume as you can see. Just like running my fingers really gently through her hair. The last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use my um, big sexy hair 
hairspray and this has like a pretty strong hold and I'm just gonna spray a little bit I don't want it to look like too crunchy <laughs> I'm just gonna kind of like fluff it up with my fingers so this is the final look like this it's like really really kind of defined curls but they're like wavy and sexy mm -hmm. turn around in the back and this is what it looks like in the back and this literally took me like 10 minutes to do so it's super super fast and easy and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and again the product I'm using is this Jose Bear um, 19 millimeter clipless curling iron yes so if you want to you could leave your hair like this but I'm gonna also show you a really cute option to do when your hair is um and all you're gonna need are a bunch of bobby pins and that's it so all you're gonna do that would be cute too if you pinned up yeah yeah you could do like cute. pin back like half or do like a little poofy thing but I'm gonna do it cool up to you so all you're gonna do is you're gonna take a bobby pin and a section of hair and you're just gonna randomly pull a section of hair like so and you're gonna twist it a couple times and then you're gonna bobby pin it down so this is what it looks like okay stay right there so I can do one more so I'm just taking a section of hair, twisting it a couple times, and I'm going to bobby pin it down. Okay? This definitely works a lot better with curly hair. Um, my hair is naturally curly, so I can kind of do this um, when I get out of the shower when my hair is just like a little bit damp. But with straight hair, it doesn't work as well because the hair won't really like curl in on itself. And you see, after I twist it, I kind of let it wrap in on itself. And then I'll just pull it up and pin it. And I'm only using one bobby pin for each piece. You might have to use a couple, depending on how big of sections you're taking. But I'm taking um, fairly small sections. You could leave like some pieces down in the front if you wanted to, like that. I'm gonna just kind of loosely pin them back. So I'm gonna like just kind of pin it up like that. And then on the other side, I'm gonna do the same thing. So come close. This is what it looks like in the front. Put your head down. And that's what, turn around, swivel, and this is what it looks like in the back. Just like, kind of messy, and if you wanted to, you could add like, a headband or something. And if you want, you could even add a flower, you could add it like that, or on the other side, depending on how you <laughs> like part your hair or whatever. Or you could accessorize it with a headband like that cute whatever you want it could be like sorry <laughs> a thick one or like a little thin one with like <laughs> I don't know where your ears are <laughs> like that that's cute like that or you could add a head scarf I'm an outlaw, I'm an outlaw, quick on the draw.